I'm Gail and welcome back to Gail's Low Carb Recipe Ideas. Today we're going to make a low carb Spanish cauliflower rice. It's delicious and you can add meat, whatever you would like with it. You're really going to enjoy this. So let's get started and I'll show you how to make it. Now I used my Hamilton Beach food processor and I shredded my cauliflower. It worked quite lovely. And now what we're going to do, um, and the size was, it was a medium size. It looks like a lot there, but it was a medium size cauliflower. Now I've got 64 grams of butter, and I'll have all the other measurements on my blog to say that it's so many tablespoons or ounces or whatever. So I'm going to let this melt. So my butter is starting to melt and I am just going to throw everything into this skillet. Um, now the next thing we've got is 50 grams of onions, white onion. I chopped and it was basically a small onion is what I used. I'm just going to kind of leave them in the middle. I will be stirring it in a couple of minutes. Then we're going to put in some red peppers. You can choose any peppers you want. I have 83 grams of pepper and we're just going to throw that in the middle as well. And I have 122 grams of mushrooms. So the white mushrooms, you can use any kind of mushrooms you'd like and I've chopped them up a bit. Now we're going to add in a half a cup of chicken broth. And we're going to add in, what have I got here? I have a tablespoon of minced garlic. Love garlic. I buy it at Costco. It's already cut up, already chopped up in a jar, and I'm going to have to buy another one. I've used up so much of it. So now we're going to add in um, a teaspoon of turmeric. And the turmeric... I bought it in a jar and dirty by the looks of it. So it's more fresh. We're going to put that in there. Now let's add in a teaspoon of paprika and then a teaspoon of Cajun spice. I love Cajun spice. And I'm going to put a teaspoon of herbamere in. And lots of times you ask me what is herbamere, so I'm going to show you herbamere. It's one of my favorite spices. I And if you haven't had it and you want to barbecue a steak, what I do is I put my barbecue at 500 and just before I'm ready to put it on the barbecue, I just sprinkle my herbamere all over my steak, both sides. Cook four minutes on each side and it is delicious. I absolutely love it. Okay, and the last thing I'm going to put in is my tomato sauce. So just try and find a tomato sauce that is very low in, in carbs. And I put in a quarter of a cup. Got a little bit in the, the dish here. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I am going to mix this up and then I am going to put the lid on. It's going to create some moisture and we will get our cauliflower cooked and, and everything else that's in this skillet. So I'm just going to put the lid on and let it cook. All right, we're ready to give this a taste. It looks delicious. So here is the final recipe, all done. It's delicious. I quite enjoy it. I'm just going to eat it out of the bowl because we're going to have it for supper anyway. Great flavor. You would never know it was cauliflower. Love it, and um, you can have 
chunks of chicken or steak or whatever you'd like in this, you'll really enjoy it. Anyway, if you'd like to go to lowcarbrecipeideas.com, you can find this recipe on there and find some of my other delicious recipes. You take care and I'll see you soon. Bye now.